Hello. Well, you must be Michael Cameron from New York. Well, splendid. Come on, come on in. <laughs> oh, my God, you look a bit beat up already. You just got here. <laughs> well, I guess you boys in Manhattan don't get out to these wild parts much, huh? <laughs> no, not pestilence or floods. They must be saving those for later. No, now I gotta deal with this pompous ass. Now, look, I know headquarters sent you out here to try and sort things out. And, uh, I know you want to help, but the fact of the matter is, I don't know what you think you're going to be able to do that I, that, uh, that we can't do. I mean, I don't want to sound territorial, but don't you think you're a bit out of your depth? Why don't you just tell me what's happened, then I'll look around a bit, and then... Look, I've been ordered to brief you, so I'll brief you. Then you can do whatever the hell you like to do, as long as you stay out of my way, hmm? So, at the beginning, I suppose you've heard about the box. Hmm. Really got the workers into a lather, <laughs> but they've been taken care of. We just up to their salaries a bit, and they're back to work. Case closed. That woman's driving me crazy with the threat of what she might do. And she knows she's driving me crazy. I think she's enjoying herself. Well, that's it, Mr. Manhattan. Why don't you go play in the sand now? If you want to look at the box, it's in the warehouse down at the end of the road. In fact, your friend Laurie's probably over there now. So you, too, can renew whatever acquaintances you had. Let's see. Here's a key to the trailer that's been set aside for you, plus one for the warehouse. Now, if you'll be so kind as to leave. I have important things to do. Leave. I'm losing my patience. Could you please leave me alone? Please? Haven't I been nice? I mean, didn't I do what was required of me? Must you push me to the limit? Now get the hell out of here! Admittedly, there's still a problem with the Egyptians. You see, their Department of Antiquities can shut us down completely if they feel we're intruding on a tomb or a major deposit of artifacts. <laughs> Not that they've always acted so harshly in the past, but a lot depends on the Egyptologists who's here at our site. You know, the one that we're required by Egyptian law to have during the operation. A lot will be determined by what she reports to them. Till now, she hasn't said much. Says she needs more time to determine if the box is evidence of a larger find. Well, personally, I think it's a fake. Lori certainly has a way of bringing out the best in a man. Oh my God, you know that woman? Christ, she'll get this place shut down if she has her way. <laughs>